Hi guys, welcome back to the House of Hughes. I am just getting ready to go to the gym this morning and I do have quite a few updates for you guys. I know that this isn't going to reflect on your end, but it's actually been a few days since I filmed anything because my family has just been going through a lot to say the least. When I say my family, I actually mean my personal family, not Hunter, Beckham, Blakely and I. I know that you guys have seen my parents on my channel just a little bit and you know that they live close to us and that Hunter and I have a really good relationship with both of my parents. Well, when I was 18, I wasn't living at my parents' house anymore and they ended up getting a dog and his name is Duke and he is obviously just so perfect and precious. I've actually shown you guys Duke on my channel a few times. He was a greater Swiss mountain dog and so although I never lived with my parents when we had him, he has been my family dog for the past 10 years. And unfortunately, he developed arthritis in his wrist and we ended up having to put him down. So my family's just been very sad, just going through a lot. I personally have actually never lost a pet until now. And so this has definitely been a very surprising and just different process for me because like I said, I've never lost or grieved a pet before and it's been really sad. It's been really, really hard, but I am just staying busy and staying in my normal routine. I am very sad, but of course I don't want him to be in pain. So I'm happy that he's not in pain, but I wasn't really able to say goodbye. So I think that's kind of the part that is the most difficult. However, I'm sure you guys know this, but Hunter's family, has two dogs Loki and Gatsby and they are like the biggest dog lovers ever so I've been really blessed to like have Hunter be a support system for me right now because he just understands how much I loved Duke and how hard it is to lose your first pet I don't know if you guys know this but Hunter was actually on his LDS mission when we were Mormon when his childhood dog died and that was obviously so traumatic for him and really really hard so he just understands and is so so kind and just has really given me the space to grieve and I think it was really hard at first I like wanted to film I almost felt a little bit silly that I like couldn't film but I was like having waves of grief where like I'd be fine for a couple hours but then I would just, you know, remember everything going on and it would be so hard and I just would cry and I just really felt like I couldn't come on camera and fake it. And so I just wanted to give you guys that little update, give you some context of why I might not seem fully like myself in some of my videos. But I just have been, you know, sad and going through that grieving process. But it is getting better as the days go on, which is really nice. And like I said, I've been staying busy. I was able to actually go with my friends all day yesterday. I didn't work at all. And I went with my friends to a day spa up at snowbird if any of you are familiar with utah you can pay like 55 bucks to go to a spa that has a steam room a sauna a hot tub a pool and it was just like the best way for me to decompress and just like get my mind off of things so i feel like i'm doing a lot better this morning like i said i'm getting ready to go to the gym and then i have a half day of work and half day with the kids so i'm really excited to just vlog today and be able to kind of get back in the groove of everything all right so you guys know how jessica is blakely's nanny so jessica does blakely's hair so cute every day and she actually slept in this so it's not fresh but it still looks so adorable she did these little bubble braids where are you going girly Oh, you're hiding. Blakely's hiding. Hey, Miss Blakely. Yeah. Who's coming over today? Halsey and Jessica. Halsey and Jessica, are you excited? Uh, oh, what is that? Snacks. Oh, it's snacks. We love that. Oh, my goodness. Someone's excited. <laughs> Cousin Halsey's here. Such a treat, huh? <laughs> yeah. So it's been a couple days and I actually feel like I'm doing quite a bit better than I was in the beginning of the vlog. The kids are playing with the Legos, Hunter's at the gym, but it is a Sunday and yesterday was Saturday and I love our Saturday tradition. It's the day that Hunter and I take off the gym and he takes Blakely to get a coffee for himself, obviously, to get her a donut and to go through the car wash every Saturday morning and he vlogged a little bit of it while I was sleeping in and I wanna insert that footage for you guys because it is so adorable. Can I see your donut? You're so cute. You wanna go through the car wash? Yes, with donut. With the donut? With the water and coffee. 
There's the car wash. Are you excited? Yes. You cannot tell me that that is not just the cutest tradition ever and Blakely will literally ask all week like when she gets to go get a donut with daddy while Beckham and mommy sleep in which is so nice but I'm actually going to close out today's vlog here. I know it was a short one but I just wanted to update you guys on kind of what's going on in our life and just kind of the update. You guys know obviously with like filming for a living if you're kind of in a funk it's really hard to come on camera but I feel blessed to be doing a lot better so I'm going to close out today vlog and just kind of leave it there with that little update on our dog and our family and then I'm going to start a new vlog later this afternoon that will hopefully be a lot more positive but I love you guys and I know you'll understand so thank you so much for supporting me in all phases of life and of course I want to remind you to be brave like Beckham and I'll catch you in the next vlog bye